it's like every day we're seeing who we are as people. When I was growing up, I, I lied for people to accept me because I didn't accept myself. Mm. So I would make up stories so, so that you would accept me into your world. I would, uh, everything I did was for someone else to like me. It wasn't until I started reading my own book about how pathetic I was as a human being. I could blame my dad, I can blame kids at school. I could blame having health issues, ADD, my mom not being around. Great mom, but she was doing her thing. I could blame a lot of people. And that's the book I was reading. And I put it off on everybody else. It wasn't until I said, you know what? For me to fix this, I gotta read what the hell, what the fuck is wrong with David Goggins? Not, not blame anybody. Read my book and say, okay, I'm afraid of my shadow. How can I overcome that? Go in the military, get your ass kicked, do things you hate to do. Be uncomfortable every fucking day of your life. Roger that. I'm not the smartest kid in the world. Okay. Instead of somebody saying, oh no, you're smart. No, no, don't say that to yourself. I said to myself, no, I'm a dumb motherfucker. Okay, Roger that. How you get smarter? Educate yourself. So the things that we run from, we run from the truth. We're running from the truth, man. So the only way I became successful was going towards the truth. As painful and as brutal as it is, it changed me. It, it allowed me to become, in my own right, you ain't do that. It's gonna be a lot worse than fuck or motherfucker. It's gonna be a lot worse. And so we are training kids and people to be soft in a world that continuously gets harder. And it doesn't, it doesn't correlate. Like that guy talking about the tear gas with the seals. Is that necessary? I don't know. But what is necessary is you have to build a person that can withstand the pressures of whatever they're going to be dealing with in life. And we don't do that. I'm not trying to send a message of run 200 miles, be the best motherfucker in the world, but be tough. You better have a part about you that's tough, a part about you that can break down situations and get better. And break down situations very quickly within some trauma in your life, some devastation in your life, because it's going to come. The devastation, the trauma is going to come, and you can't allow that to become a jersey barrier. It can't be a jersey barrier. It has to be something that you can maneuver through very quickly and move forward. That takes a lot of toughness.